This is just too good. I get slick equipment, a nice ride, and a ready supply of every explosive there ever was. I think this will do, boss. Does this mean you can actually follow orders once in a while? Stranger things have happened. Trust me. You keep me happy, I'll keep you happy. Now let's go put some of this fancy equipment to use. All right, boss. Time to talk some business. Bunch of credits just came through from a weapons deal I had going on Balmora. Another weapons deal I had going back on Balmora. This is your cut. How many schemes do you have going, Vic? They're not schemes. They're opportunities. And not just for me. You're the new boss. You get a cut no matter what. Let me tell you, boss, this is not where I figured I'd end up when I enlisted. Growing up on Nar Shadda, you only join the army for the free ticket out of there. You enlisted so you could leave Nar Shadda? You better believe it. Before the army, I ran with whatever gang had the loosest boss and the most spare debt night. Had a long list of enemies. Even street trash take it bad when you blow up their buddies. Wish you could go home again? I've been back to that slime hole plenty of times. The heat's more than died down now. Joining up turned out to be the best idea I ever had. A lot more fun than running with those scrubs back on the streets. Most of the time. What's not to like? A lot of rules. Can't just beat down the people who come to enforce them. Have to play nice. Or smart. Hey, enough reminiscing. Let's go trash something, huh? Hey, come here. This is going to be hilarious. Remember the credits I brought in from that old weapon sale? Those were from my second buyer. The first guy I lined up wasn't offering as much as I liked, so I bailed on him. Cheap jerk is all worked up that I sold him to someone else. He's trying to put a scare in me. Wouldn't it be easier to just ignore the guy? Easier? Sure. But this is more fun. Guy's name is Red Hand Magarin. He runs a few guns. Thinks he's a real tough guy. Hey there, Red. My guns, Vic. Where are they? Well, I was having a chat with my new boss, the commander of Havoc Squad. And we decided to go with another buyer. If that's the commander of Havoc Squad, I'm the king of Alderaan. I want those guns, Vic. I assure you, I'm Havoc Squad CEO. I hope Vic's paying you good to get on my nerves. When you back out on a deal with me, there are consequences, Vic. I'll be seeing you. Uh-oh. Consequences. I hope I don't lose any sleep. I can't believe he thought we'd be scared of him. No joke. I'm glad we didn't do business with him. We'd look stupid. Come on. Let's find something else to do. So, turns out Red Hand Magarin isn't just an idiot with a chip on his shoulder about that weapons deal I bailed on. He's also an idiot with a lot of bounty hunters on call. He's put a price on my head. I need to take care of it. Do whatever you need to do, Vic. Magarin's office is on Nar Shadda. I still know a few people there who don't want me dead, so this shouldn't take long. Once Magarin's settled, we'll be good to go again. I can back you up if you want. Nah, I've been through this a couple of times before. It'll go faster solo. Thanks, though. Be back later. Hey, boss. Everything's cleared up. No more price on my head. Well, no one to pay it anyway. How exactly did you clear all this up? We hugged and made up. What do you think I did? I found some of Magarin's files while I was picking through the wreckage afterward. Figured they might come in handy. I'll let you know if I spot anything interesting. I've been looking over the customer files from Magarin's office. The guy really didn't know how to run an outfit. 
When you're selling guns, you always get the money up front. You only take installments from customers you can grab when they don't pay. Magarin had installment customers all over the galaxy. And, big surprise, a lot of them never paid off their bills. Amateur. I'm surprised Magarin would hire people to go after you, but not his debtors. You only want to be dead, and hired killers come cheap these days. Good debt collectors are expensive. You actually have to trust them. There are credits to be made. People owed Magarin. I took him down, which means his stuff is my stuff now. Well, sorry, our stuff. Everyone who owed him owes me now. I'll look through the lists, find the big debts, and collect, and give you a reasonable cut. How's that sound? Make it happen, Vic. You got it, boss. I have to tell you, boss. I'm impressed. I wasn't sure I'd like coming back to the army, but it's worked out great. Mostly thanks to you. You sounded eager enough when you first got into Havoc. Well, I knew it'd be better than Balmora, but I didn't expect I'd like it this much. I've worked with a lot of people over the years. Stupid, greedy people I cut loose as soon as I could. But you? Actually useful. Even taught me a thing or two in a fight. It's a nice change. I enjoy working with you too, Vic. Of course you do. These ops wouldn't be any fun without me around. Come on, let's get back to that war I keep hearing about. Found our first customer boss, an Alderanian noble named Albrecht. He was into Magarin for quite a few credits. Once I work out the final details, it's all ours. Let me know when everything's ready. I've got a good feeling about this boss. I think this might just be the best plan I've ever been part of. Long as we're not kicked out of the military, we'll do pretty well for ourselves. What got you kicked out before? I don't remember half the list of charges. You know me like to keep busy. The last straw was a protection racket I ran while I was stationed on Talay. It was really fun while it lasted. The plan only worked for a few weeks before someone whined to the higher-ups. I was the ringleader, so I took most of the heat. Not easy being in charge, is it? Nope. Glad I don't have to deal with that nonsense anymore. I'll let you know when everything's lined up. Then I'll go pay the noble Lord Albrecht a visit. Everything's ready, boss. I've got Lord Albrecht's location on Alderaan and all of the files that prove the debt. I just have to walk in, show the files, act tough, and we can both become a little bit richer. This guy must have gotten a lot of weapons from Magarin or he would know so much. Yeah, the old kook bought enough blasters to outfit a whole platoon. He probably can't lift a single one of them. The guy's pushing 70 years old. What could go wrong? See you when I've got the credits. was ridiculous. Turns out there's two Lord Albrechts. A father-son team. A crazy old man and stuck-up little punk team, really. Neither of them had a single credit, and both of them had promised to sell the guns to three different buyers apiece. How'd you deal with them? It took a lot of wrangling, but I managed to get those two saps into the same room with all of their buyers. Then I lobbed a couple of grenades in. Most of the buyers' credits were still in one piece afterward, so I'm calling it a win. Little blow-ups like that are bound to draw some attention, Vic. I didn't use rep issue frags. I'm not an amateur. Anybody who looks will figure it's another arms deal gone bad. Happens all the time. Let's hope the next rundown isn't so tough. The stress might ruin my looks. All right, boss. You got me. Working together like we've been doing, it's a gold mine. If you're up for making this a long-term arrangement, then count me in. You definitely make a good team, Vic. Couldn't agree more. Not a mark in the galaxy that can handle both of us, boss. Let's get out there and make some credits. <laughs>